right, everybody, welcome back to JTS Cards. Today we've got a wall of trout, um, but we're going to be opening up this update series. Uh, I think this is called the Hobby Box. We've got a lot of blasters to go through, but we're not doing all those right now. Let's just get to the big one, right? So uh, I'm a fan of this update series. I've gotten a lot of really cool cards from it. And, I mean, you just never know. You just never know. So, anyway, let's get right to it. If you haven't seen this channel before, it's where the lighting and the sound are terrible and the host is even worse, but we still have fun opening cards. My goal today is to find something that is uh, kind of exciting. What we can do is maybe open up a few uh, packs at a time and just go through them. There's a lot of packs in here as I'm smacking the camera around. You know, that's what I like to do. I've already told you the host is terrible, so, you know, you just kind of have to get used to it. Um, let me go ahead and get some of these bad boys opened up here. And maybe we'll go through things a little bit quicker. I'm not going to spend time talking about all the individual base cards. We'll just glance at those. We're going to get a lot of them, obviously. And yeah, that pack didn't work out for me at all. All right, let's see here. Let's get a few going here. I don't know if you saw my World Baseball Classic videos, but man, there were some fun cards in there. All right, we're just going to go through and see if we can get something that's not a base card. All right, let's see. I'm going to bring the camera down a little bit, make it a little easier for you to see. Well, Nolan Ryan, some team cards. Really wish they'd get their act together and just have all the baseball cards go in the same direction. I think that would be pretty cool. Save us from doing a lot of flipping around. All right. All star game. Time spanning tandems. So far, it looks like we're just getting all the base cards. Got something that's backwards. Not number, oh, it is number two. 20, 2023. A little Cooper Hummel. All right, let's get these base cards moved off to the side. You can see I got a few cards off over there. I've got a lot of things I gotta sort. If I get something numbered or autographed, boom. I mean I'm putting that in a special place right away. But uh the base cards, I think I've mentioned it. I know I've mentioned it. I'm gonna start doing some sort of a, an art project with them. I already have the stuff to do it, I'm kind of planning it out. Hopefully that'll be something I can get done in a couple weeks and I don't know, just show you. It'll be something for just for fun. For funsies, as they say. Alright. I got a relic card in Ozzy Albies. All-star stitches. That's cool. Pop him in a penny sleeve right away. And you know what? I might as well put him in a top loader. This top loader is a little big for it, but for now, we'll take it. Pretty cool. I guess that's the one relic we're going to end up getting in this. It says you can get one relic or one autograph, so just wondering if that's the end of our excitement or if there's going to be something else. It's kind of why I'm going through these a little quicker. Most people aren't too excited about just opening base cards, action stars. Corbin Carroll. We'll take it. All right. Get you off over to your friends over there. Just making all kinds of noise over here. Hey, if you're um, watching the video and you got some cool cards, throw in the comments. I love reading the comments. I, I think I've responded to every comment anyone's ever said to me. I think. If I've missed you, I'm sorry. But, um, yeah, I'd love to hear about what you got and 
you know, what you're excited to see. Um, you know, based on some of my comments that people have sent, I picked certain types of cards to open next, so. And I've had some emails, you know, you can email me directly. And uh, people just asking, like, hey, do you have any of these? I'm like, oh, yeah. I have a lot of, a lot of cards. So, we'll be getting to, uh, to a lot more soon. JP Fire Eisen? All right. It's a nice little parallel. Let's see. All right. We're moving right along. Wow. Please put the cards in order. I do save all my 35th anniversary cards. Actually, some of them are going to be part of my art project. Kodai Senga, black and gold. Team cards. If anyone knows of like a charity that, you know, because what I do is I repackage these. I actually just shrink wrap them real fast in big bulk groups. And if you know of some place that, you know, kids could use some of that stuff, I wouldn't mind sending it there. Masataka Yoshida. But I'll need your input to tell me where those places are. I mean, we have a few local places I could do it here, but I don't know if that's the thing. But if there's something particular you know about, yeah, let me know. More information I have, the better. I mean, it cost me ten bucks to mail a bunch of stuff. Priority mail, so for ten bucks, I get to help some kids or something. I'm in. So well, let's see here. Let's see a parallel in there. We'll get to it. All right. Let's see. All right. Oops. 35th anniversary? No. Oh, that's cool. I have yet to get one of these blue or baby blue. I don't know what they call it. Justin Verlander, 35th anniversary for the Mets. That's cool. Well, because you're a color that I don't have, you're going to go into a top loader. That's the way we do it. Nice. Shohei All-Star Game. What a player he uh, he has been. I hope that he continues that. I hope he doesn't get hurt. I hope we get all season next year to watch him play. When he heals, I'd love to see him pitch again. Impressive that he can do pitching and batting. Brian... Rocio, okay, that's the parallel that we saw. All right. Another Adley. Ronald Acuna Jr., 35th anniversary. Team cards. All right, well, so far you can see that this hobby box is... Uh, not full of amazing stuff. It's got some cool stuff. But I don't think that we got anything we would want to say, oh, we hit it. You know? It's always fun to hit something. I love my autograph cards. I love my red foil cards. All right, let's just open up this last pack. Get through all of them, and then we'll do that four trading card update pack in the back there the hobby exclusive all right let's see come on come on give us some love hey if you haven't done it yet please like the video please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it already i'm trying to get to 500 subscribers I'm a, you know, not quite there. So I'd love to have 500 people that are interested in what we're doing. Freddie Freeman. All right. 
You know, if you really don't want to listen to me, you could turn off notifications. But I need you to sub to subscribe. <laughs> no, come on. It'd be fun. Numbered to 50. 44 out of, out of 50. Alex Call. Okay. That's awesome. Again, that's the card. Number 45 of 50. We shall take it. You know what? I better put them in a top loader right now. If you watch my videos, you know I fling cards around and things like that. I don't want that to happen and mess it up. All right. We're almost done here with these. Then we'll do that last pack. Aces. All aces. Dwight Gooden. Nice. Good old Dwight. And the rest are the base. All right. Let's get these out of the way. You can see how many base cards we got. We got one out of uh, 2023. All right. Let's check out this hobby exclusive pack. They call these things mojos. Ben Joyce. Adley Rutschman. Rookie. That's cool. I like it. Guardians. Logan Allen. Estuary Ruiz. Poster pools by Tops. All right. Thanks, everybody. You can see what we got, what we didn't get. Ozzy Albies uh, looks like a piece of his all-star game uniform. Anyway, thanks for joining me. I'll definitely see you on the next uh, break here. Have a great one.